Hello, welcome back to another awesome let's play of Mass Effect 3. Um I'm just gonna show you this real quickly. Um before I get anywhere further in this game, I'm going to make a, a, a ditched effort ditched effort to get depths up to all hundred. It's actually a kind of a bitch because there's uh, it's kind of a bitch because I don't like to play the multiplayer too much. And I'm not really good at it. I'm good at single player because AI is kind of fucking stupid, but you don't know how hard they are, but I don't know. I'll see where this takes me. Um, and I'll let you know, like, like maybe like 30 parts in, and I'll let you guys see another update of this. But for now, this is the last time you'll see it, so if you ever see it again, you'll see this up higher. Alright, I'll take you guys into the game now. Okay, let's get this back on. Boltproof glass. Touche. Yeah, it's Shepard. You didn't notice before I was kicking your ass? I just got a headshot through it. Hey, that's it. It's time for a beer. <sighs> that's the shit. I never got a headshot through that before on any game, even Marvel Two. Understood. Shotgun shooter model V. Do this shit. Ash. The hell is that? So this is what it looks like. Hell no. Shepherd. Bitch. Elusive man. Okay, why hold the gun up to him? Fascinating race, the okay. Philippians. They left all this for us to discover, but we squandered it. The Alliance has known about the archives for more than 30 years. And what have they done with it? What do you want? What I've always wanted. The data in these artifacts holds the key to solving the Reaper threat. I've seen your solution. Your people are turned into monsters. Hardly. They're being improved. Improved? That's what separates us, Shepard. Where you see a means to destroy, I see a way to control, to dominate and harness the Reaper's power. Imagine how strong humanity would be if we controlled them. You've gone too far. The Reapers will kill us all if we don't stop fighting each other. I don't expect you to understand, Shepard. And I'm certainly not looking for your approval. You were a tool. An agent with a singular purpose. In that, you were successful. But like the rest of the rebels in this place, your time is over. Enough talk. We are. Don't interfere with my plan, Shepard. I won't warn you again. Duly noted. Shepard. What? The data, it's not here. It's being erased. 
Why? Goodbye, Shepard. <clears throat> Damn it. How's he doing? It's local. Someone's uploading the information. Hey. Step away from the console. Now. Yo, shit. Oh, cat fight. Cat fight. Aw. Aw, ended too quickly. the moment where what what instant shield oh hell no oh bitch going down chase that bitch ah uh, okay where the fuck That would not work on her. The fuck. Down there. James, you read me? Everyone has the data. Radio to Normandy. Get them down here now. Hell yeah! What? That's right. Orders. Finish. You whore. Son of oh. Grab that thing. Bring it with us. Shepard, we got Reaper signatures in orbit. Ash. Come on, Ash. I'm getting you out of here. Bitch, she has a helmet. What the fuck? How is she? Losing. I mean, how hard was she hitting her? Oh shit, we got full on Reaper bullshit. That was bullshit. Dude, she had a helmet on. Fuck that. All I want to do is got her a concussion. I want to fucking put her out of her damn misery. Yeah, knock her out, but she's not dead. She dies right here. It's fucking horseshit.
Ashley needs medical attention. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. Get us to the Citadel, Joker. Roger that. Hold on, Ash. See what you and Edie can learn from that thing. Commander, I'm receiving a signal over the secondary QEC. I believe it's Admiral Hackett. Patch me through. Oh god, the Admiral's alive? Edie, can you clear this up? I'll do my best. Did you get to the archives? I was there. So was the elusive man. I was worried Cerberus might try something. Did you get the data? Most of it. He downloaded some before I could stop him. Edie and Liara are analyzing what we recovered. What have you learned? Was it worth the effort? Preliminary evidence suggests the data is a blueprint for a Prothean device. Device? A weapon, massive in size and scope, that's capable of unquantifiable levels of destruction. Send me the data. We'll do our own analysis. If Liara's instincts are right, this might be the key to stopping the Reapers. I hope so. Ashley's been hurt. We're taking her to the Citadel. Sorry to hear that, Shepard. But we both know this is just the beginning. Oh, hell Talk yeah. to the Council, show them what you found. With luck. They'll give you all the support we need. And if they don't? Do whatever it takes to get them on board. I'll be in touch soon. Hack it out. Commander. Edie is extracting data from the Cerberus machine. We'll have details to present to the Council by the time we reach the Citadel. A dash? I've done what I can for her. She needs proper medical attention soon. The Admiral's right. It's going to get worse, isn't it? Unless we stop the Reapers. Yeah. You think what it's gonna be? I've looked at the data. This weapon could be the answer if we can build it. I get the sense you don't quite believe it, though. You didn't see what they did to Earth. How is one weapon supposed to stop them? What are our options? You know we can't win this conventionally. Commander? Why not? Isn't it worth trying, at least? I'm going to check on Ash. Make sure we're ready to present our findings to the Council. I'm sure the Council will see the need to help. It'll be a hell of a short war if they don't. We're back to this shit place of a shit hole. Wow. One man wanted to take over this place. It would take him... More lead than I can than you can ever imagine. Jesus Christ! You know how many people are in this thing? Last time I read on the facts thing was 42 trillion. 42 trillion. That's a lot of people. A lot of people, but aliens and people. Here. Him out. Sh what the f <sighs> Where are you taking her? Where to Memorial? Best care in the Citadel. We're not going with? We need to see the Council. Right. Uh oh. Here comes Mick Ass behind. Looks like they might be coming to see you. Commander Shepard. Got word you were arriving. Captain Bailey. Good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Though it's Commander now. Congratulations. Uh, thanks. 
Now half my job is dealing with political bullshit and escorting dignitaries around. No offense. None taken. So, you're here to bring us to the Council? I'm here to tell you the Council is expecting you, but they are dealing with their own problems with the war and everything. Uh, they apologize for the inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. Meet them here at Adina's office. They'll be ready soon enough. All right. You might have time to go by the medical center if you want to check on progress over there. Meeting with the Council is our top priority. I'll head up to Adina's office now. Meet you there. One of my men can show you the way. You? I'm just a tourist today. I'll try not to get in any trouble. Commander, we've got a situation in the embassy quarters. We could use your help. I'll be right there. The other half of my job. I'll see you around, Shepard. No doubt. Okay. I'm sitting here thinking to myself, okay. You both, you, oh, you just saw that, right? You saw her get hit in the head, in the back. I understand that could cause some damage due to the helmet's shape, but fuck. Holy shit, that's a lot of funny. Holy shit. Uh, okay. Fuck that. She is not in stable. Cause she's in normal. Could fucking people think, oh, you didn't hit in the back of the head that fucking hard and put you into a mental state where you can't get up? Unless her fucking diet. Just God damn it. Mm, these elevators. Those elevators will get you, okay? Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Okay, um, which way was it supposed to go? Oh, that's right, it was this way. I haven't been in this place in so long. It's been like forever. Welcome to the Torian side. Commander, Councillor Udina said you'd be coming. If you'll follow me, the council is already in session. <coughs> Councillor, the Reapers are in our space as well. Earth is no more or less important than any council homeworld. But Earth was the first council world hit. By all reports, it faces the brunt of the attack. How do you know this is the brunt? New Reaper fronts are opening up everywhere. The reports are accurate. Earth was attacked. A full-scale invasion. And it's just the beginning. We need your help. Everything you can spare. Earth may be suffering, but our worlds are falling too. The Turians have lost Tatris. We must fight this enemy together. Need I remind you that the last time we fought the Reapers, Shepard sacrificed the Council to protect human interests. True, but in the end we survived because we followed Shepard's lead. And what if that's not enough this time? The reports are dire. If we throw everything we have at the Reapers on Earth and lose, what then? I don't expect you to follow me without a plan. Counselors, we have that plan. A blueprint created by the Protheans during their war with the Reapers. Prothean? What is it exactly? We're still piecing it together. But it appears to be a weapon of some sort. And this is capable of destroying the Reapers? So it would seem. It's immense and intricate. This is a fool's errand. The Protheans were wiped out by the Reapers. Clearly, the weapon is flawed. It was incomplete. There was a missing component, here. Something referred to only as the Catalyst. But they ran out of time before they could finish building it. Do you believe in this, Shepard? After what you've seen of the Reapers? Liara believes it can work, and so do I. And while I haven't always agreed with Adina, he's right about this. We need to stand together, now more than ever. The Reapers won't stop at Earth. They'll destroy every organic being in the galaxy if we don't find a way to stop them. She's a bitch. The Council cannot give Earth the military support it needs. Our own planets must come first. The Salarian Union is convening a summit amongst our species. If we can secure our own borders, we may be able to aid you. I'm not gonna help our you, fleets bitch. Are also engaged. Honesty is all I can offer, Commander. I will not make a promise of rescue that I cannot keep. 
Shepard, meet me in my office. I hope that's an offer of support. I'll be digging up what I can on this Prothean device, Shepard. God... Damn it! They're a bunch of self-concerned jackasses, Shepard. We may have a spot on the Council, but humanity will always be considered second-rate. How can they be so blind? Commander, I can't give you what you're asking for, but I can tell you how to get it. I'm listening. Palavin's Primark Fedorian is the one that called the War Summit. He's your kind of man, open to extreme solutions. Trouble is, he didn't get out of Palavin's system when the Reapers attacked. We don't know if he's alive. He's essential to the summit. If the Normandy could extract him without being detected... You want me to rescue his ass in the hopes he considers helping Earth? Put bluntly, yes. I shouldn't even be telling you about it. But we need Fedorian alive, and your ship can get him. Save the Primarch, gain an ally. One with the power to grant you what you're looking for. While the Reapers ravage Earth. Your counselor was right. We need to work together. This is the best way to get that. <laughs> Our intel says Primarch Fedorian is on Palavin's largest moon. Get in and out undetected, and he'll take care of the rest. Good luck, Commander. You're gonna need it. There is one other thing. The Council has agreed to reinstate your Spectre status. And there are certain resources that will be made available to you. Good luck. Well, that went well. It's a start. I'll talk to the others in the meantime. See if we can support this summit. Move things along. Thanks. Hey, fucking dipshits. Alright. Oh shit. Hey, Commander. Liara told me the Council's not interested in helping us. Something like that. <laughs> Why would they? Look at this place. There's no war here. People are whispering about it. They're talking about it. But they don't really believe it. I can hardly believe it myself. Like everything back on Earth was some kind of nightmare. Yeah. That's what I hate most. It's like this place wants you to forget that. So, you still want to go back to Earth? Hell yeah, but... Bud, you were right. So was Anderson. We can't stop them alone. Besides, looks like you're gonna have your hands full convincing these pendejo politicians to help us. And I'm up for it. Whatever it takes. Glad to hear it. I'm gonna head down to some of the lower levels where they keep it real. You got some spare time? You should come and find me. Maybe I'll do that. <sighs> You know, be truthful. His reaction to Shepard after I saw the last Paragon. I honestly. Dude. I don't know. It's just. It seems like that. There's, it seems like it's two versions of James. There's the Mass Effect 3 James, and then there's the last Paragon James. Or Paragon James. This one's this James seems like more like a I'm gonna stay t quiet type of badass, and the other one's like more of an open badass. So. Patient stable for now. That was touch and go. Good work, Doctor Freyla. Narrow split. Ash. Hey. It's Shepard. I should have known you'd pull through. You're stubborn. Always were. How did she get a black eye? Scared me pretty bad back there on Mars. I just wanted to check in on you. See how you're doing. You hang in there, alright? 
I need you up and reporting for duty ASAP. You hear me, soldier? If you need anything, Doc, let me know. Okay, Ash. You take care. Her hands in her belly. She <laughs> just realized that. I'll see you soon. Why are you on the ground? Get up and get on the chair, you dipshit. Right, let's see if you Hi, Doctor. Didn't expect to see you again so soon. Well, we need to prescribe you another round of antibiotics. For when I ship out? I have some bad news. Your squad applied the Metagel correctly, but infection had already set in by the time they found you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we have to remove your leg below the knee. What? But... I... I... I don't understand. It doesn't even hurt. It would if we took you off the painkillers, Lieutenant. That's gonna suck it. Nothing. No, wait, what's in here? <sighs> it's complete absolute shit. Fuck, I just wasted like five minutes of your guys' time. I'm sorry. I thought there was like a, there was like a freaking, man, it looks like he's running with a stick up his ass. I don't think Jacob's in here just yet. Welcome to Serta. Profits from sales go to help new medical research. Thank you for coming to Serta. How can we help you? Serta is a non profit organization dedicated to the Be medical safe. needs of all sapient life. But just two things, right now. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. One moment, please. God damn it. Mm. Now arriving at docking bay D24. <laughs> I'm still gonna meet that fat bitch. There she is. Hello, fat bitch. I saw it dock. Was last seen on Earth. Did Commander Shepard escape? He did, didn't he? So why would he be here unless he's seeing the council? Ma'am, I can't talk about that. You don't have to. Commander Shepard! Oh, God. What's going on here? Commander, just who I was looking for. Diana Allers, Alliance News Network. I think we can help each other. I suppose you wanted an interview. Even better. I'm a military reporter with a show called Battle Space. We're carried on just about all council planets. My producers want me embedded on a human ship, and I want that ship to be the Normandy. Why would I want that? Wars can be won or lost in the editing room, and this war needs to be won. I've got Alliance security clearance and operate without a crew. You get veto power over the segments I file. Can you handle an arrangement like that, or do I keep looking? Tell your producers yes, for now. We'll see how it works out. Report to the ship as soon as possible. Any questions? How much gear can I bring? One foot locker. Aye, aye, Commander. <sighs> Almost say, what the fuck? Why? Why? We're, we're under attack. Why did me, badass music start going on? I know there was one thing in here. Was it? Uh. 
Alright, fuck it, I'm just gonna get out of here. Haul ass to the exit. Go, 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 go. Move it, get in there. Get your ass in there. Yes, return to the army. Okay. Ah, oh, not this shit. God damn it. She puts, she makes you want to feel bad too much. Jeez. Come on. A deceiving nightmare. Liara, can I help you? I've been forwarding the Turian counselor information on the Prothean device. It can't be built without council support, but he's not budging until their Primarch is safe. I know. Are you all right? I didn't get what you'd call a good night's rest. There's more to it than that, isn't there? What's really bothering you? When the Reapers hit, I could hear people screaming in the streets below me. We left a lot of them behind. There's no way for you to save them all. But I know you're doing everything you can, and you'll get back there in time to help. I hope you're right. Don't blame yourself, Commander. Commander Shepard, I'm Specialist... Oh. Uh, I, I beg your pardon. I thought you were alone. I was just leaving. Commander Shepard, I'm Comm Specialist Samantha Trainer with Alliance R&D. I was part of the team retrofitting the Normandy after you turned it over to the Alliance. There weren't many of us aboard when the Reapers hit. Slow down, Specialist Trainer. You're doing fine. Thank you. I worked in a lab. I never thought I'd be serving on a ship. Why don't you tell me about the retrofits? The ship's in line with Alliance regs now, and it has new, top-of-the-line, quantum entanglement communicators. In fact, Admiral Anderson had intended to use the Normandy as his mobile command center. That's no longer an option. Yes, I heard he chose to stay and fight. I in any event, I'm honored to serve under you, Commander. For as long as you need me, that is. They only sent me here to oversee the retrofits. Shepard, some of our systems require further testing, and Specialist Trainer has been extremely effective during installation. I would prefer that she remain. Got it, Edie. Wait, since when does a virtual intelligence make requests? Edie's an AI, fully self-aware. Oh, I knew it. I knew Joker was lying. Jeff requested that I pretend to be a simple VI to protect myself. I apologize for the deception. Thanks, E.D., and I apologize for all those times I talked about how... Mm, attractive your voice was. Anyway, shall I give you a tour? I think you'll be impressed by the new upgrades. 
In the CIC, you'll find the galaxy map where you can set the Normandy's destination. You can also check your messages at your private terminal. The War Room houses a strategic command center for mission-specific intel and war analysis. The shuttle bay contains an armory where you can modify your equipment between missions. Finally, Liara has set up a lot of hardware down in the old XO office on Deck 3. I think she's claimed that room. And there you are. Still the same ship as before, it just flies Alliance colors now. Speaking of which, I believe Admiral Hackett would like to speak to you at the VidCon. Oh shit. Oh god, no, Admiral. <laughs> okay. God damn it. Commander. Wadena updated me on your meeting with the Council. Sounds like they're running scared. We did present them with a lot of unknowns. They're feeling threatened and want immediate solutions, not theories. Theories are all we've got right now. What's your plan? I'm trying to get the Turian Primarch for a summit meeting with the Asari and Salarians. I'll bypass the Council and appeal directly to their leadership. That's good, I like it. This is where we start laying the groundwork for our counterattack. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot to back it up right now. Then build alliances. Gather everything and everybody you can for the cause. What about the Prothean device? Find me people who can help build it, and if you can't, I'll take ships, soldiers, supplies, whatever you can get. We need to keep hitting the Reapers across every theater of war they open. Buy us time to figure out the device. And when it's finished? Assuming it ever is, we pool all our resources. Think of it as a giant armada for delivering the device, when the Reapers are most vulnerable. The stronger you can make that armada, the better the chances of punching through. What about Earth, sir? We'll just have to hope Anderson and what's left of the Alliance forces can hold out until we've dealt with the enemy. I understand. Good. Then make it happen, Commander. I'll be expecting regular updates on your progress. Hack it out. So if I was to attack now, it'd be me against everything. Let to buy some DLC. lab on Sanctum. Commander, come to check on your new recruit. Just wanted to see how you were doing. Still trying to get my bearings. When I was working on the Normandy's upgrades, I left at the end of the day. I didn't even have a toothbrush or a change of clothing until I made some emergency purchases on the Citadel. Next time you need something, just ask. We're all in this together. Oh, it, it, it's no trouble, Commander. I'm sure you have larger concerns. We can put in a requisition order. My toothbrush is a Scission Promark 4. It uses tiny mass effect fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. It costs 6,000 credits. Okay, yeah. You're on your own with that. In any event, I appreciate you giving me the chance to stay. Okay, yeah. Was there anything else? Carry on, specialist. I'm just, I'm just trying to stay awake here, so. Human territories. Fleet Admiral Hacker has declared the threat condition Saber 1. Oh, fuck. Confirm Chilson Earth is under repair attack.
Oh shit, no, we attacked the Joker. Oh no, 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 we're gonna go attack the Joker. What we're gonna do? Hello, Joker. Hey, Commander. You know, I had my doubts about the Council. But after years of ignoring your warnings, they're finally willing to step up and tell you they just can't help. They've spent years denying the threat. You think they'd be prepared now? I was kind of hoping that maybe they were planning in secret and just not telling you about it because, you know, Cerberus. Well, let me know if you want me to get them on the channel and then hang up on them. You know, for old time's sake. God damn it. Just god damn it. Hey, I wonder. Oh, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> Shepard's dead. Galaxy lost. Oh, we're boned. I can upgrade this bitch? Oh, hash. It's like a 60 cow. So it's more beautiful. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna end this here. It's been a it's been a good time. I'm just tired. I wanna get on to my other let's play, so I will get this updated tomorrow if I can. Um I'll let you know. Um If you're all wondering why I have all this shit is cause I just said fuck it, I'm going to be I, I just took my other character I've been using for this game for like a year and a half now and he's been upgraded a lot so far. I mean, continue upgrade where he's the the top badass. Make him like level 200, and he's only level 50 right now, and a lot more money upgrade. So when I go through all this, 
get all these upgrades, and I get to the final mission, play this game on the hardest difficulty, I'll be ready for it. It's pretty much I'm building up to it. Alright, well, I'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow.